immediately say that my dear Arjun, you are posing yourself as very learned man, but you are fool number one. Why? Not because you are identifying yourself with this body, my dear Arjun. You are talking just like very learned man, but you are lamenting on the uh, subject matter of your body. Actually, one who is learned, he has no uh, necessity for lamenting on the subject, on the body, either living or dead. So the whole process of education in the materialistic way of civilization is on the body. How to keep the body fit, how to avoid death, how to avoid uh, disease. Simply concentration on the body. So this bodily concept of life is immediately discouraged in the Bhagavad Gita. Pandita, that those who are learned, they are not affected by this body either dead or alive. Uh, so that means uh, one should be inquisitive to learn about the uh, soul which is sitting in the body. That is their knowledge. So one who is inquisitive about uh, understanding, he requires a spiritual body. Not that one who wants to keep this body fit or wants to reduce fat. For him there is no necessity of spiritual body. Uh, that if he can go to a doctor or a medical physician, that's how he can advise. What is the use of going to a spiritual master? Spiritual master means who can teach you about the highest uh, benediction. He is spiritual master.